All right, so today I'm gonna do a video on how to change your backside settings without completely clearing the Raven. Now, when I say backside settings, I'm talking about uh, speed source and control valve type. So if you press and hold on this self-test button, it's gonna blink. So US units, SP2, standard valve. US, SP2, standard valve. And if you press and hold for 30 seconds or so, it will finally stop flashing. There, it stopped flashing, right? There. So now we hit enter to accept the US units. Now your speed source, I am running an Astro, of course. So that is gonna be SP2 always. So I can scroll SP1, SP2, SP1, SP2. So I want SP2, enter. Now, a lot of times what we have to change is our valve type. I am running a standard valve, but if I wasn't, I could hit CE and change over to different. That's a PWM closed, standard, fast, fast close, PWM, PWM closed. Again, I'm running a standard. I'm gonna hit enter, and there, I just changed my uh, I was able to change my valve type and my speed source without clearing. Press and hold on the self-test button, and uh, that will get it done. Now, another thing the self-test button allows you to do is when I'm running through the field, I have my screen looking like this. I hit my speed button on the bottom so that I'm showing my speed because I need to make sure that my speed on this matches the speed of whatever I'm driving. Because if it doesn't, my rate's never gonna be right. So I'm always watching my speed. So I've got my speed here and my rate here. Those are my two important settings and that's what I have showing. Now, if I wanna just do a self-test sitting here in the yard, hit self-test, enter, enter five miles an hour, enter. And then if I were to turn this on, it would con it would fire up my section valves and everything. It's beeping because it's not reading any flow. So those are some functions of the self-test button on the Raven.